Hi, my Scorpios. It's Jamie Zebra 23. Um, I am doing your spread for um, your exes. How your ex feels about you, what your ex is doing, what's going on with the ex. For September 14th, 2017 to September 28th, 2017 for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Um, I keep wanting to say Sagittarius, so a lot of you have a Sagittarius ex. Um, your Sagittarius ex is very much, ugh, like, yeah. Yes, if uh, the Sagittarius man or a woman, if they could, they would uh, they would go kidnap you and lock you up in the basement and keep you there forever. Yeah. So, um, some of you are planning on, um, well, okay. <laughs> okay, I'm trying to get out of that Sagittarius thing. Okay. Okay, judgment. So a lot of you, you have um, you have exes that do want to get back together with you, but you've got to use your judgment. Um, you've got fellow water signs, Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, um, that would like to get back together with you. Okay, if you do get back together with a Cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio, a Gemini, a Libra, or an Aquarius, it will not be. You won't. It won't work. It will not work. But there is definitely a water that wants to get back together with you, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Um, some of you did get back together with a, with a water, with a fellow water sign. You guys broke up again, but now they want you back again. Um, decide what you're going to do. There was like a week of a breakup, I guess. I, I feel like you guys have been breaking up, making up, breaking up, making up for those of you water on water relationships, water and air relationships. Yes. Um, also, your ex, some of you that were dealing with Sagittarius or Aries, they're coming back quick. Sagittarius or Aries, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, a little bit of water here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, expect for them to make a return very, very quickly. This will not be, this will not be somebody dragging their feet. This is somebody like ringing your doorbell. You open the door and they got all their shit on your front lawn. Like somebody's trying to get back together. Somebody's not taking no for an answer anymore, Scorpio. So whether you want to get back together with this person or not, um, they're like, okay, you don't have a choice. You're going to be with me. Okay. Like, listen, um, even if I got to share you, uh, yeah. Even though you got back together with your husband, um, ask your wife if she's into the polygamous thing. Like you got, you got some Scorpio, be careful. Cause I know what they say about Scorpios. You, once you go Scorpio, you'll never be the same. You guys got something about you that makes everybody go nuts. Scorpios keep me in business. Everybody contacts me about a Scorpio. Okay. All right. Gemini's too. I'm sorry, baby. Gemini's are great too. Gemini's are magical too. Sorry. Gemini's, Gemini's. Okay. <laughs> okay. And then we got here. And then we got here with the seven of uh, the seven of cups, the judgment card, and then the eight of uh, the eight of wands. With this, this also means too that for some of you that are uh, considering having a one night stand, a one last hit, hit and run with a with a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries, don't do it because you will regret it. Scorpio, behave yourselves. Don't no more hit it and quit it, especially if it has to do with Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries. Please don't open that can of worms. Ta ta for now.